I'm here to talk to you about our preschool pages. Um, any of these books with these preschool pages I collect because I am a big fan of getting books into my son's hands and I don't want to worry about them being too destroyed. So what are these fantastic preschool pages? They are thick cardstock, they're laminated. In about a year, he hasn't managed to tear one since. Animally is by far his favorite. You can see there is a little bit of wearing on the binding, but, um, and the pages have been folded here and there, but they haven't been torn. And that makes me super, super happy as an anal book freak. Um, so these are great. We took this one on a cruise with us, super humid, out in the middle of the ocean, and it got all wrinkly. And when we got back to Utah, it was fantastic. So I really recommend these if you have kids that are hard on books or um, just toddlers and babies in general. So next we have I'm a Dirty Dinosaur. This was one of the very first books I got in my kit. There's not a lot of wear and tear on it. That's why I love these books because they're really hard for kids to destroy. So then you have its companion book, I'm a Hungry Dinosaur, all about making a delicious chocolate cake. Same rhythmic story, love those. Um, thousand things. We have several of these, so whatever your kid's into, you can find a different one. Um, but this one's all about things that go. Cars, trucks, planes, bicycles. I mean, I've learned about some things in here that I was like, what? So I really, really like these. Like all these different sailboats. Who even knew? I didn't. Um, up next, we have our very first book of things to spot series. These are kind of like for 18 months and up. They're super easy to just kids. Counting, find two striped top, socks, um, colors, animals. They're fun, but they're easy. They're made for little kids. One step up from that, you have the picture puzzle books. There's about four in this series, and they're these gorgeously designed pages. This is one of those books, if you see, designed by. It's not an author. They're designers designed for children to engage them, bring them into the book, into the story. I mean, find two hot dogs on the flamingo page. Totally random, but kids get looking, and they love all the different animals. And this is, this is a gorgeous series. So then we have another storybook. B is for bedtime. It goes through the alphabet and is a great bedtime story. This is another one of my son's favorites. He loves to read it before nap time. He'll go pick it out. So a lot of fun. And up last, we have our big book of colors. Um, gorgeous, teaches kids all about colors and different types, different shades. In the back, you have this fun page that teaches kids about mixing colors and what it does. So thanks. Those are all our preschool books.